Hello and welcome to the Digital Fox WordPress Quick Tip. And in this quick tip, what I want to show you is how simple and easy it is to add Google Analytics to your site so that you can keep track of a ton of statistics of visitors, how long they're spending uh, visiting your website, and a lot of other great stats that's going to allow you to be very successful with your website. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to log into the admin of your website, which is your domain name dash, oh, I'm sorry, domain name forward slash WP dash admin. And of course, the best way to do this is to install a plugin, and I've already done that. So what we want to do is come down here into settings, and the plugin that we're looking for is Google Analytics. And what you do is you go up to plugins, you go add new, and you're going to go ahead and do a search for Google Analytics, and this plugin is called Google Analytica. So find that plugin, install it, go through the process to activate it, and we will uh, then come back down here to settings and we will set up the plugin. It's actually very simple and easy to do. And um, right here, as you can see, it's currently disabled. It's not activated. So uh, why don't we um, go ahead and click the enable here. Okay, and then let's click here to log in to Google and authenticate um, our, our plugin. So we'll go ahead and click that button. And what this does is this is basically setting up an API. It's saying, basically allowing my website to communicate with Google and giving it permission to do that. And we need to do that first in order for it to be able to share information. So I'm going to go ahead and grant access. And boom, it's basically been authorized. So now I can come down here where it says Google Analytics account and I can select the account that I want to install. And the one that I really want to use is the Digital Fox. We'll go ahead and select that then we can go through all of the features here and you can kind of um, set those up to your liking the way that you like. Um, I'm not going to spend too much time on it because it's really going to be different for everybody and this could be kind of a long video otherwise. So go ahead and spend the time to go through there and decide which settings work best for you. And we're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom and go ahead and click save. And Oh, it looks like I guess we need to enable it once we've done that. I guess since we did the authorization, it, it refreshed it. So let's try that one more time and go ahead and click save. And boom, now it is enabled. It's ready to go. And what you can do is one thing that's really cool is if you go to the dashboard of your site, um, right over here it says Google Analytics Summary. And it's still loading, but right now we just installed it, so there's not going to be a whole lot of stats. And the reason why I'm showing stats is because I have this plugin installed on all of my uh, sites that are under the Digital Fox, and it's kind of showing you um, how this is going and, and how it's growing and where all my stats are coming from. So you can actually be right inside of your website and visit um, and, and, and view a lot of your Google Analytics information. And of course, you can always go over to Google Analytics and you'll be able to view the exact same report and they have something that's a little more in-depth um, that will uh, you know, allow you to customize um, your, your research, um, your stats, so that you can really get the most out of it. And, and this information, you really want to look at it every single day and find out which posts are being the most successful, how can you tweak it, um, and just continue to just uh, drive your keywords so that you can become very successful in the keywords and on your website. Thank you guys very much. If you have any questions or comments uh, or concerns, please use the comment box down below. I know this video was really quick and it's this plugin and this uh, Google Analytics is very, very deep and I could spend a lot of time on it. And, and if I get some requests, maybe what I'll do is I'll put together a, a full course on it to kind of show you guys exactly how to use it and, and to get a lot of value. But it, really, it's a lot of fun. You can get in and look around. Um, it's great to kind of find out what's working and what's not working. So thank you guys very much. Please help me to continue to spread the word about these videos, share it on your Facebook and Twitter, and let's get your friends and families and associates here so we can teach them how to take their website to the next level as well. Thank you guys very much, and I look forward to seeing you online soon.